Hello, everybody. It's Scott Bunce, and I am really excited today to introduce you to one of the members of our group, Leo Falkenstein. And Leo, will you please tell us what you do and maybe a little bit about your company? Thanks, Scott. Yeah, so I'm Leo Falkenstein, co-founder and executive producer at Consume Media. Consume Media is a video marketing agency. We are based in Atlanta. Our office is in Peachtree Corners. And as a video marketing agency, essentially what we do is we create videos for businesses to help them achieve their business goals. We tend to say companies all have to do the same three things, right? They need to attract new leads. They need to convert those leads into customers. And then once they have customers, they need to make sure that the customers are successful so that they can, the customers refer business, they stay customers and everyone's happy. So we have video solutions that help our customers with each of those goals. There's a handful of other things as well, employer branding. So culture and recruiting videos, uh, content at events. And sometimes we've, we've, We've been known to do some long form documentaries and uh, thought leadership content for our businesses as well. But yeah, that's a little sneak peek as of what we do at Consume Media. I, I love it. Um, so when you were thinking about becoming a Vistage member, what were the components? What were you looking for? How did you get to the decision that you did uh, to choose to be part of this Vistage group? Sure. Yeah. I've known about Vistage for several years now and have had some conversations along the way. And um, ultimately, you know, I think with a lot of with a lot of business and a lot of personal items, there's somewhat of a catalyst that makes you think, hey, it's time to do this. Um a couple catalysts for me. Number one, I think our business has been doing really well for the last few years, but I think we got to a point where we could expedite some of the growth that we could have. Um, just learning from others, meeting others, having a peer group, having great conversations. I think just having people to speak to and hear their problems, help them solve their problems, which inevitably teaching or coaching or helping others ultimately helps you. Um, so that was one of the main reasons. Um, another one is, let's, I'll be honest, I, I got my first child coming on the way in October. And Congratulations. that's going to change my life drastically. I want to, and, you know, I, I've never... I'm a first-time business owner, and now I'm about to be a first-time business owner with a first-time child. I got to figure out how to help my business run better. I'm, I work hard. I'm always going to work hard, but I also want to make sure that I'm using my time most effectively so that I can be a present father and spend good time with my family. So again, helping my business grow, but also helping me figure out how to use my time the best and having a great peer group to, to talk with, learn from, and, and troubleshoot problems with. Yeah, I found that a lot of members get stuck, right? They, uh, they're they so into the weeds on their day-to-day -day business that they don't take a step back and, and bounce ideas off of somebody else on how to become more efficient and and delegate. And, and, and let's face it, uh, small business owners uh, struggle to delegate, right? They, they know how to do it better than anybody. And, you know, do you take the time to train? Do you... Uh, do you outsource uh, and 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 what's the process along the way? Awesome. Uh, so Leo, you've you've already processed a couple of issues, and I I don't mean to put you on the spot, and certainly don't because confidentiality is one of our our our, our tenants in this Vistage group. So don't say anything you're you're uncomfortable saying, but can you talk about any of the issues you've processed or in our one to one time together and how it might have helped you? Yeah, totally. And one thing I should have mentioned, a reason I joined Vistage is the business coaching side of it, not just the peer group. But Scott, we've been able to have some really, really great conversations. You've been great at asking questions, getting me to think about things a different way. And I think along with the peer group component, the business coaching component is also just invaluable. So uh, just shout out to you for that and shout out to Vistage for setting up the systems. But yeah, look, um, I think I'm in the professional services business. I own a video marketing agency and we don't have a product that you buy off the shelf, right? You have a product that people put hours into and ultimately 
in some way, shape or form, we are billing for our time. And that's all we bill for, right? So one of the things that we've talked about, uh, both in our business coaching sessions and in the peer group, is how do we maximize uh, our employees' time so that they are able to drive results for the business, but also deliver themselves opportunities for growth? Um, and I've gotten some really, really great feedback. Scott, you've asked some great questions that put some ideas into action. A couple of our peer group members have given some really good suggestions of things that we've tried out and things that have been super helpful. And, you know, some of the things you learn is sometimes the idea that a peer group group member gives you is a good first step, right? It's a good first step and that's going to trickle down or, or make its way into the next step. There was one idea that, an, that a peer member gave me and it was such a good idea that the, the they didn't, the, the, my team did not want me to keep doing what, I, what they asked me to do. So how did that change things? They changed their behavior and actions a little bit. And ultimately, because there was something that, you know, did drive productivity or drive some uncomfortability, they didn't want that anymore. And ultimately, they changed their behavior. So we wouldn't have to do that anymore. So that's just without giving away too many details. That's uh, that's uh, something that we have processed and some actions we have taken. Nice. Now, uh, you know, you, you're a professional, right? You you do what you do better than uh, probably most people in your space. And as you were making this decision, you actually looked at other organizations outside of Vistage. What, what did you discover along the way? What was the differentiating point where you, instead of going uh, to another group or eat, because a lot of members will uh, even be part of more than one group, what was it that uh, uh, put you toward Vistage? I think a lot of it was the people that I met in the group session. I think from my first time as a guest, I felt comfortable instantly. Um, I felt like everyone was vulnerable. I felt like everyone wanted to tell their stories and probably even most importantly, everyone wanted to help each other, right? And that's something that you don't get by an online community or something like that, you know? being in a room, meeting people, building relationships, that's a huge um, benefit of Vistage. You get to meet people from a variety of different industries. And I think there are benefits to two different sides, right? There are benefits to being in a peer group with people in industries just like you, right? Because they are solving the same exact problems. But at the same point, there's another huge benefit to hearing from people in different industries, right? Ultimately hearing from, okay, I've actually never heard this problem before, but I have something that I tried in my industry. Maybe this will work for you. Um, so I think the relationships, the variety of perspectives, the vulnerability, and and I think I'll double back down on the relationships. I'm new. Um, I've been able to meet some really, really great people in our group. I think a big goal of mine uh, we've talked about this, Scott, is to build better relationships with these people, take them out to lunch, take them out for breakfast, learn about their families, uh, which we talk about that in Vistage as well, which was something I wasn't expecting when we joined uh, to talk more about, to also talk about the personal lives along with just the business lives. So those are some of the reasons that I wanted to join and some of the benefits that I'm getting out of it already. Excellent. Well, Leo, I think you've been a tremendous uh, member in the short time you've been with us. And I want to thank you again for uh, taking some time to uh, make this recording with us. Just full disclosure, everybody, this is not Leo's uh, uh, setup and recording. Otherwise, it would be much more professional than, <laughs> than I'm doing. But again, thanks, Leo. And uh, I'm excited to have you part of the team. Awesome. Thank you so much, Scott.